my thesis at Harvard was on designing the Port of New York and New Jersey. And I found as an architect very quickly when you change such massive scales, when you're no longer just thinking about the envelope of the building, but when you're looking at a vast territory, especially of flows, coordinations, overlaps of commodities coming in and out of the port, um, a different set of graphic conventions needed to be found. So the architectural plan didn't work as well any longer, but the more um, graphic diagrams started to coordinate information in a better way. So that's how I kind of found myself between this world of architecture and graphic design. Graphic design really is a new type of representation for architecture. There is very little on the point of the subject matter and one of the things that inspired me to write this book was I was looking at a lot of different graphic design books and there was one book on grids and page organization. There was one book or lots of books about typography. There's lots of books about color theory but there was never anything that put it all together and made sense for the work that I needed to do as an architect. So this was something that I was really inspired to sort of synthesize my experience and also to motivate, use the book as a platform Form for other practices that have started to work between this mode of graphic and architectural representation. So the book not only is filled with diagrams and explanations and a lot of different ways of, of thinking about how architects and graphic design fit together, but it also has a series of interviews between each chapter where I've highlighted uh, different firms or different artists who are working at these intersections, asked them about their work and included that in the manual as well. Well. well, I think all professions, not just architecture, but all professions are going to absolutely need to have greater visual literacy. So how information is represented, how to read a map, how to make an effective pie chart, that's not just something for graphic designers, and it's certainly not just something for architects, but all professions are going to need to have better skills. So I'm excited for this book to really be taking a stand and putting a lot of these ideas together. Really, this hope for my the book is that it not only will open up possibilities for architects to think about enriching their uh, collaborations with other disciplines. I mean, certainly architects have had a great moment collaborating with structural engineers. We've had great moments collaborating with artists. We definitely need to have more great mo moments of collaborating with graphic designers. And so instead of the graphic design or the architect throwing up their hands and just giving over a signage to a subcontractor and say, do whatever you need to do. I hope that this book will start to open up opportunities for really thinking about how those two professions can better work together. Because architects need to know a lot more about graphic design. And graphic designers, I think, have had an incredible impact on the field of architecture. It has gone largely unrecognized.